Good evening, I'm Jessica Harrington. Here's what's making headlines around Kern County. One of the suspects arrested for the murder of Hardeep Singh faced a Kern County judge today. Tina Marie Hawthorne was in court on murder charges this afternoon. She was wanted in connection to Singh's murder, which happened last November in Southwest Bakersfield. Hawthorne is now due back in court on the 27th, but police are still looking for 19 year old Kenton McDaniel and 20 year old Tymere Ross in connection to Singh's murder. Police say if you see them, call 911 and do not approach. Kern County's unemployment numbers were released and it shows the numbers are on the rise. The unemployment rate in Kern County was 8.7% in June, up from 7.7% one month before. Now this compares with the unemployment rate of 4.5% for California and 4.2% for the nation during the same period. The worst unemployment rate in Kern County is in Mettler, where it's 26.6%. Close second is Onyx at 26.1%, then Delano at 25.6%. Pine Mountain Club has the best rate at 2.6%. And some other good news tonight after the Golden Empire Gleaners air conditioning unit was stripped of copper and broken. They had nothing to keep them cool in this triple digit heat. But today they announced the community stepped up big time with a $9,000 donation to replace the AC unit. Gleaners say they are thankful for the California Resources Corporation and countless others who came together to help keep them up and running. And I'm Allison Gargaro. Today marked the 10th day in this heat wave, but we could be breaking that later this weekend. But a new heat wave begins on Monday, and an executive heat watch is in effect Tuesday, continuing through Thursday. Temperatures could range anywhere from 103 up to 108. That's your latest news and weather headlines. For the latest news anytime, be sure to log on to our website, turn to 23.com.